Today, we're at the Nicholson Center in Warren, a facility that helps adults with developmental disabilities. We sat down with Executive Director Rob Nicholson to talk about the center and its future plans for expansion. It's only been open for a little more than a year, but the Nicholson Center in Warren is growing fast. The number of clients coming here with developmental disabilities catapulting from 26 in December to 110 in January. I think we're ready for a change in the community. And while sheltered workshops are, are great facilities with great programs, uh, it was time for something new. The Nicholson Center is what's called a day hab, where clients can move freely and socialize. You know, I think that it's really that socialization that's so important to them and the freedom to you know, be able to interact with each other and be treated like adults. For years, it's primarily been the county that provides programs for developmentally disabled adults. Now private providers like the Nicholson Center are popping up across the state. Individuals with developmental disabilities have been on wait lists for years. So the more service providers, you know, the better, the more choices. The Nicholson Center is funded through Medicaid programs and private contracts with residential providers. It offers clients an entrepreneurial work program where they earn a paycheck. Currently we do screen printing for t-shirts, we do paper shredding for local businesses, and uh, we're pursuing a few other opportunities right now. The center also offers art and music therapy, as well as money management and safety courses. What's your favorite thing to do while you're here? My favorite thing to do, I like to do everything in this place. I love it. Mainly my specialty is artwork. And these are your pieces that we're looking at here on the table, right? Yes. And what did you make these for? The dance. We have one coming up, the sock hop. Do you dance? Yes. I dance a lot. The Nicholson Center has now purchased property in Niles, the former Moose Lodge, where it plans to expand. I'm looking at all kinds of different programs so that you know we'll have two centers that really can compete with each other for quality. They're also planning a social club, the first of its kind in the United States. A place for development of the disabled adults to go uh, in the evenings and socialize, you know, sing karaoke, dance like nobody's watching, and have a great time with their friends. And what is the most rewarding part of this job for you? Definitely the clients. Um, you know, I really try and enjoy their lives, and they're such amazing people. Um, I think that they keep me honest. They enrich my life. So, with the new facility and the opening of the very first social club of its kind in the country in Niles, Ohio, the Nicholson Center looks forward to much more growth and expansion right here in our valley. With the Regional Chamber Report, I'm Kim Gonda.